नेक्स्ट इज क्वेश्चन नंबर टू पॉइंट वन फाइव एंड एक्वेस्ट सोल्यूशन ऑफ टू परसेंट नॉन वोलाटाइल सोल्यूट एक्सर्ट्स अ प्रेशर ऑफ वन पॉइंट जीरो जीरो फोर बार एट नॉर्मल बॉइलिंग पॉइंट ऑफ सॉल्वेंट वॉट इज अ मोल अ मास ऑफ सोल्यूट सो हियर वेन यू आर सेंग अ सोल्यूशन वी विल कंसिडर द सॉल्वेंट एज वॉटर और राइट सो हियर वी कैन टेल दैट अज्यूमिंग वी कैन अज्यूम वी कैन से हियर अज्यूमिंग the solvent to be water we can say that the boiling point of water is 100 degree celsius we are doing this because of normal boiling point so we're just considering here now because bar is present pressure is present and all of that we need to calculate molar mass one simple way where we can calculate is from relative lowering of vapor pressure the equation for this let's write the equation for this now so that is pa not minus pa divided by pa not equals wb into ma divided by mb into wa don't get confused i'll explain you what these things mean so now wherever we have component a ma wa so we can write here that component a is going to depict solvent always so that means component b should be solute all right now pa not so p a not is vapor pressure of pure solvent and p a is vapor pressure of solution so we know what each term means let's substitute the values so now from these values vapor pressure of pure solvent so that is the vapor pressure of pure solvent in this case our solvent is water so sometimes this particular value will be given to us in the question or we will have to calculate it or we will have to memorize it that is vapor pressure of water is 1.013 bar either you memorize it or very rarely it will be given to you in the question so this is nothing but pa not next one pa that is vapor pressure of solution it is clearly given to you in the question here 1.004 bar then from this 2% non volatile solute is told so we can say because it is 2% of solute we can tell mass of solution to be 100 g and mass of solute is 2% meaning 2 by 100 yes, into 100 grams this will be 2 grams all right so we have now what is the mass of solute we know what is the mass of solvent solution mass of solute we can easily calculate what is the mass of solvent so mass of solvent is what mass of solution which is 100 g minus the mass of solute which is 2 g simplify this i will get 98 g which is the mass of solvent all right now after all this let's see what all values we have from here we have the pa not which is this we have pa weight of solute weight of solute here is there 2 g MA, which is the weight of solvent, which is water, molar mass of solvent water is not there. We need to calculate it. Molar mass of solute is what we are asked to calculate. Weight of your solvent is given here, ninety-eight grams. What are we left out to calculate? MA, which we can easily calculate, which is the ma molar mass of molar mass of water. 
mola mass of water all of us know by heart it is 18 grams now we have all the values let's substitute it here so pa naught is 1.013 minus pa is 1.004 divided by pa naught is 1.013 equals wb is the weight of solute weight of solute is 2 grams into ma is the molar mass of solvent that is 18 grams divided by mb is the molar mass of the solute that's what we have to calculate into wa is the weight of the solvent which is 98 grams this minus here you get 0.009 by 1.013 equals these two when you multiply you get 36 divided by 98 into mb cross multiply them when you cross multiply 98 into 0 0.009 will give 0 0.882 into mb equals 36 into 1.03 is 36. 468 easily you can calculate what is mb so mb is equal to 36.468 divided by 0 0.882 when i divide it i will get 41.34 grams that is going to be the molar mass of the solute